What's up, everybody? It's Grim, and we are here, and we are watching WWE Survivor Series 2018, and we just watched Nia Jax be the sole survivor for Team Raw in the opening contest, and who predicted it? This fat man right here. Off the top rope? Because she turned bad. She gave in to the hate because everybody's booing her because, you know, she jacked up Becky Lynch's face. And they're like, they booed her when she came out anyway. They know nobody's going to cheer for her. They might as well make her bad. So. She's kind of the big show kind of thing, right? Yeah, yeah. A face heel, face heel. Are you trying to say? No, the big show thing of being a face and a heel all the time. Okay. I just want to make sure you're not saying anything that's going to get us in trouble. No. Come on now. <laughs> I'm not you, okay? Wait, wait, I, what are you talking about? So anyway, I would never do that, such a thing to yeah, beautiful yeah, God nice. Yeah. yeah. We are best friends. <laughs> Alexa Bliss, let, first of all, there was a count out in there. Yeah, I hate when there's uh, count out. Especially double count out eliminations. Come on. Too stupid. We don't want to see that crap. But I picked Maya to win because she's my best friend. And she did win. And, 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 and Mandy Rose was on the team. They added her last minute. Right? Same with Driller for Charlotte. Bailey and Sasha. So Bailey and Sasha, Sasha. They replaced Natalia and who else? Ruby Riot. Ruby Riot. And and Naomi was the first one out of the match. She's captain. Yeah, getting pinned by Tamina. What's up with that? How dare you do Naomi that dirty? I mean. What? What? <laughs> I mean, it was a decent match. Tamina, it was a little Tamina, bit slow. Tamina did her dirty. Yeah. An injustice. <laughs> a miscarriage of justice. Yeah, it was a solid match. Nothing spectacular. Can we talk about, first of all, the pre-show match? Because I want to get to the pre-show match because there was a big pre-show match and it was a 20-man a cluster crap. <laughs> 21, like, there, and then there were, like, three guys outside. Yeah. Too. Yeah. We're just, why not just have the Royal Rumble? Yeah. <laughs> it was a... I think uh, Corey Graves said something like that. <laughs> it looks, like, it looks like we're getting ready for the Royal Rumble. 10-team elimination tag team Survivor Series match. Team Raw versus Team SmackDown. In the end, the Usos were the sole surviving team, but there were so many people who almost died in the match. Chad Gable did a German suplex off the top to one of the Usos to the outside. What's wrong with you? Why would you do that? Big E dove through the ropes and nearly killed, who was it, Dash or Dickhole? Dash, Dash Wilder. Yeah. Dash or who? Dash or Dickhole? I don't think I know Dickhole. Oh, yeah, yeah. He was one of them. He's Dash's tag team partner. Almost died. Kalisto almost died. His ass, his little ass got injured. He's going to be at the uh, pediatrician in the morning. <laughs> he is no longer the great Kalisto. He is injured Kalisto. But the Usos won that as a sole survivor, and Barbara got that one right. Now, remember, we have a bet. The bet is, if I win, I get to replace all my broken action figures. And we don't have to buy furniture for the stupid house. I hope you win. If she wins, we have to buy couches wait, wait, wait. Uh, and couches. tables. Wait, wait, wait. That's wait, wait, so wait. boring. Will we get to sit on the couches? Mm -hmm. Yes. Fart but I kind of hope she wins. Yeah, but you're, she's not, no, she might not let you sit on the couch because she thinks you fart up the couches. No, which no, is no, why we're no, here we at his house. We don't fart on the couches. <laughs> well, I'm here to fart on your I'm couch. I'm on my couch right now. I, uh -huh. mean, I have another question, though. Why would you pick the raw tag teams? Why would you pick the raw tag teams? That is the worst division of tag teams. Because I'm too stupid. No teams on that team. Because I'm too stupid. Where the hell was Rhino and Slater? Not even on the show. Not even on the show. People were pissed. The Colognes got on the team. Yeah. The Colognes! Where's, where's I didn't even know they still worked there. Where's Rusev? Where is Rusev? Where is Rusev? It's all Aiden's fault, so... What are you gonna do? What a waste. They broke up recent day. Yeah. He's not in a tag team anymore. Controversy is afoot at the Survivor Series. We just had the match with Rollins versus Shitstain Nakamura on. But, 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 but. Enzo Amore is in the second row. I seen him. I seen him. And, and I seen it on Twitter. It's confirmed. He's wearing a wig. He's wearing a white hoodie. Why the hell is Enzo here? What the f is happening? And, and then not only that. He bought a ticket. And then not only that, but. Now, now that Rollins has just defeated Nakamura, Raw is up two to nothing over Smack. Two to nothing? But wait, wait a minute! What? What? Didn't SmackDown win on the pre-show? Didn't sure the Usos win a match? I'm pretty sure I saw that match. Yeah, it didn't happen. Doesn't count. But then why the hell are you fucking having it? Why would you have a big right. brand? So twenty guys in a match in a big cluster. So there's seven matches on the card. 
right? Is this like a best of seven? So when Raw but the cruiserweight wins, title when match. Raw wins four, then this is show, the right? cruiserweight title match doesn't count. It's yeah. not Raw versus it's not Smackdown. a brand thing. That's true. Yeah. So they this need is, SmackDown. Match they match. need it. It's just so they stupid. Why would you even have a match for brand supremacy if it doesn't count towards the total for brand supremacy? Stupid. They made all that blue gear for nothing. Oh yeah. All that red gear for wait, nothing. Wait, but you know what? SmackDown won the kickoff show, one nothing. That's it. He's got a point. He's got a point. He's got a point. <laughs> so Rollins versus Nakamura was not that great of a match. I mean, it wasn't bad, but it wasn't anything to write home about. Spectacular. Surprised they had a clean finish. Yeah, clean finish. No Ambrose. Where the hell was he? He's at home washing his jeans. <laughs> I can't say tights. Maybe he didn't have a blue tights. t-shirt to wear tonight. Did you get the tight? Or, the or tights. Red. That was a tights joke. Batman. He's at home washing his tights. I said he's at home washing his jeans. I missed that one. That was... It's. <laughs> <laughs> you all. It's Batman with Michael Keaton and Jack Nichols. <laughs> Reference. I don't remember that line. <laughs> oh, You're the terrible. Original Batman movie. Still don't remember. That. Whatever. All right. Now they're showing Braun backstage talking shit to Finn Balor here. No, he said, he said he's all right. They're still friends. Oh, okay. Maybe we can, make, maybe we can make a few more last-minute changes to this card. <laughs> Put Leo Rush in there. Lashley. 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 What is this show? What is this show? Enzo Amore. I was right. He was there in the second row. And as the AOP versus the bar match began... He ripped off his hoodie, he ripped off his wig, he stood up on the chair and he starts yelling, how you doing? He's wearing a shirt that says, I'm doing great. You clearly bought a ticket to sit in the second yeah, row. You're not doing that great. Yeah, not doing that great. I mean, why would you need that much attention if you were doing great? Fail. <laughs> Fail. Then we had the AOP versus the bar, and, and I felt bad because all anybody could think about and tweet about and talk about was Enzo. And, and, and then Drake Maverick pissed his pants to distract Big Show in the bar, and the AOP win the match, and now Raw is up three to Goose Because the pre-show don't count. One more victory by Raw, and we go home early. Yeah, yeah we, we don't... Best of seven, seven, four wins, you're done. Yeah, we're done. Oh, it's, it's, it's over. Just like a World Series. And you know Brock's not going to lose, because Brock... Because Brock... You're going to eat those words when Brian hits him with the solid steel flying knee. We'll see. <laughs> Trying to steal the show or what? 205 Live just stole the show. Oh, well, Enzo stole the show. But these guys secondly stole the show. They're killing each other. Buddy Murphy and Mustafa Ali. Yeah. Yes. They just, oh my God, Buddy Lee is the cruiserweight champion, and he threw this Mustafa Ali all over the ring. The dude taking the sickest bumps in the history of our sport. Why would you do that to your body? Oh, yeah, because they have a huge spot on a pay-per-view, and they're like, we're going to show you what 205 Live is all about. You made me a fan, man. You going to watch really? next week? Oh, probably not. <laughs> <laughs> There's too much wrestling. Yeah. Put those guys on Raw, for sake. Why? They used to. Why not? I, they should be in main roster. Why do you got to divide them into something else? Why can't those dudes fight Finn Balor and Seth Rollins? That was amazing. Yeah. They're, they're, they're almost the same weight, so... <laughs> That's what I'm saying. Pretty close. Pretty close. Buddy Ali retains the Cruiserweight Championship in an epic oh, match. If you... WrestleMania. Buddy Murphy. You said Buddy Ali, didn't you? Like twice. Probably. <laughs> <laughs> Whatever his name is. <laughs> <laughs> Times two. <laughs> Mustafa I'm Murphy. <laughs> Mustafa <laughs> Murphy and Buddy Ali. <laughs> <laughs> F you, Grim, unsubscribe. Okay, so we just had a pretty good match. Raw versus SmackDown, the five-on-five -five elimination. Raw is kicking we, ass. We can go home now. It, it's over. It's, it's over. over. Raw won just won again. They're ending the pay-per-view early now. Who were the sole survivors? We had Braun, Drew, and Lashley. Lash Lash Lashley. 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 But, but the real storyline of the match was, first of all, Baron Foreskin and Braun Strowman going at it, and, and Braun almost turning on the team. But then Miz... Well, well Braun attacked, uh, attacked Drew, right? So yeah. now he gets no title shot? <laughs> That's yeah. what Stephanie yeah. said. Uh, yeah. Braun, what are you doing, man? Why are you so stupid, you big friggin' lumberjack jerk? Meat Castle. Meat Castle? <laughs> yeah, he called him a Meat Castle. <laughs> Drew, <laughs> sack on fire, called him a Meat Castle. <laughs> Anyhow, getting back to Miz and Shane O'Mac. The Miz kept tagging in Shane McMahon to do stupid stunts. Shane O'Mac was doing more high spots than Jeff Hardy. 
He's, he jumped through the, the announce table. He did the coast to coast two times. He got clotheslined out of midair. And in the end, he was the sole survivor of Team SmackDown until Braun beat his ass down. And that's it. Team Raw's just d- dominated. We have- they won the series four, four to nothing, so paper's over. Good night, everybody. <laughs> Two matches are left. Brock and Daniel Bryan, and then uh, Ronda versus Charlotte. And, um, I don't see that Brock match going long, because Brock. Ronda's going to win, yeah. and, and Brock's going to win. You know, like, What's the over-under of um, Brock bumps? Uh, Brock won't take any bumps. <laughs> He's going to do like two we'll or three F5s. Out, we'll put it at half a bump. Are you taking the over or the under? (laughs) (laughs) I'll take it over. He'll take one bump. Okay. (laughs) Ronda Rousey defeats Charlotte, but by disqualification. Because Charlotte brought out a kendo stick for no reason and started beating her with it. Why the hell did Charlotte do that? She's crazy. She's crazy. Was this the same finish they would have done with Becky? Becky just would have beat her with a kendo stick and got DQ'd? Same yeah, probably. Probably the same finish. And, and then the referees come out, and Charlotte's kicking the crap out of them, and Ronda's all bruised up with kendo stick shots. Oh. She's left laying in a lump. Those things hurt so much. They do. They're real, and they bruise up your body. If anybody... She's bleeding from the ears. If they hurt, go out and get a kendo stick and beat your buddy with it. <laughs> don't do that. Don't listen to them. Because you'll be injured. Like Ronda is. Well, that's what we used to do. And Well, because we're too Shut stupid. Up. Please don't, don't try. Home. Means. Right. I'm a professional. I'm not. I'm a professional. <laughs> Shut up. <laughs> so, Raw's up again. That's it. It's over. Raw's. Before that, it was a good match, though. Yeah. No, epic oh. match. That was five stars. Oh. Solid. Solid as hell. Probably the best match of the night besides the cruiserweights. So, yeah. Raw has won a best of nine she series. Had an yes. Bruise on her arm. Because chop this way, chop that way. <laughs> chop, chop, chop the Ronda. Chop, chop, Charles, chop the Charles Ronda. Found <laughs> There's no X's, Charlotte. Zarlet. <laughs> she was trying. It just turned out to be an X. Wow! Brock Lesnar versus Daniel Bryan was actually awesome as hell! They started off slow. They started off slow. Out, dragging yeah. Out. Well, that's to kill some time. It's only 10 30 and the pay per view's over. But yeah, Brock Lesnar comes out and nearly murders Daniel Bryan. He just throws him for, what, seven or eight suplexes? And we're just sitting here like, just ended. It's over. He's dead. Stop! Stop! He's already dead. But then Daniel Bryan mounts a comeback! And then there was a back, it's a fourth, it's a back, it's a fourth. And Daniel Bryan knocks out the referee. Six to zero. Oh my god, Raw wins six to zero over SmackDown. And the important thing, Brock took a bump, so if you took the over, yeah. you win. You won. Over under set and a half. I told you. I actually thought Daniel Bryan was gonna pull it off for a couple times. Yeah, that, and that that was why it's a good match, because you actually thought Daniel Bryan believe, might win. They made you believe Brian had a chance. Right. We, and he had when he had Brock in the friggin' cross face thing, <laughs> Brock's eyes. Shifty like, eyes. <laughs> his eyes were hilarious. <laughs> Brock got kicked right in the penis. <laughs> That's his weakness. Yes, yes, his penis is his weakness. His penis is his weakness. And the referee was selling. He was out. They brawled on the outside for a little bit, and then in the end, F five. Took out Daniel Bryan. Brock Lesnar wins. Raw wins. Raw oh, dominates. The best of eleven series, six games to none. But 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 but. <laughs> the pre-show. SmackDown count. won the pre-show, so one to even. nothing. So they're even. So they're even. They're even. SmackDown won the pre-show. Raw won the pay-per-view. Yeah, yeah, one to one. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, and it works. Yeah. And we thank you guys so much for watching our reactions vlog. Let me know what you thought of the show in the comments below. I read all the comments. What do you think about Enzo? Was that a storyline? No, that was legit. The idiot was tweeting about his album, and he was trending on Twitter, and he just wanted to promote his stupid little album. Kind of smart. No. No. Imagine, <laughs> imagine you worked at Walmart and then got fired from Walmart and then walked back into Walmart well, and make an idiot of yourself. Let's see how many albums he sells, <laughs> records, whatever the hell they call them now. He's not 13. Yeah. yeah, 13. <laughs> Guys, thanks for watching. And if you're not down with that, we got three words for you. Eat it. Yeah.